Well, it is just sitting here. Wait, there's a note beside it. Dear Alex, I thought you could use a drink. Steady your nerves. I'll be gone a while. Floyd. Well, that's thoughtful. No point waiting for Floyd in here, I guess. Also da war der Drink Bloody Mary mit einer Nachricht. Liebe Alex, nimm den Drink, während du wartest, oder so ähnlich auf jeden Fall, Floyd. Die Frage ist doch jetzt, warum kennt er sie? Hm. All the tables are laid with food. It still looks hot. Where are the diners? Ich muss sagen, ich finde es nicht mehr so ansprechend, seit ich weiß, wie es ausgesehen hat. Das habe ich noch ziemlich lebhaft in Erinnerung hier. I'd freeze to death by open the ja, window. Ja, ja, das wissen wir. A window looking out into the night. The train's moving fast. Und da ist die Tür wieder mal aufgegangen. Ich mag keine Kinder in Horrorspielen. Uh, hi. Hey. Mm. Schön. Das ist ja echt einladend. There's only one bag here. Is this girl traveling alone? I'm not going to rummage through her bag right in front of her. Ja, ich würde da auch nicht reingucken, wenn ich dich wäre. Nur als kurzer kleiner Reminder, hier saß der Grub, dieser dieses Wesen und hier war dann später auch das Licht mit dem bewegenden sich bewegenden Sack und dem anderen schwarzen Teil. A music box. It's playing a beautiful melancholy waltz. I shouldn't mess with it. I might upset her. A lantern. A fairly typical one, as far as lanterns go. Hello, Lydia. Hey, how are you doing, kiddo? I'm... I'm fine, thank you. How are you, Mom? <laughs> hey, call me Alex. I'm not old yet. <laughs> You're older than me. True. What are you, four? Five? I'm eight, actually. Oh, well, we're almost the same age then. You must be a big girl traveling alone this late at night. Yep. I'm going to see my daddy. Your daddy live in Nipawamzet? What a silly name. No, he doesn't live there. Well, okay. Is that where your daddy lives? Actually, I... Actually, I lost my father. Tonight. Is that why you look so sad? I... No, actually. He... He'd been suffering. It was better this way. I said my goodbyes already. Grown-ups are weird. Yeah. Don't I know it. Anyway, let's not talk about that. What do you want to talk about? Also, sie hat sie gefragt, warum sie so in der Nacht alleine reist, ob sie ihren Vater sie, Also, das kleine Mädchen hat gesagt, sie möchte ihren Vater besuchen. Und äh, woraufhin Alex gefragt hat, ob der da wohnt, und das tut er offensichtlich nicht. Aber, naja. Tell me about yourself. You travel alone a lot? Ah, uh -uh. first time. I used to hate traveling alone. I hate it. I love it now. Weird, huh? Why did you hate it? Uh, it's nothing a kid needs to hear. Just lonely, angsty things. Are you not lonely anymore? No, I'm super lonely. I'm just at peace with that. Grown-ups? Weird. <laughs> Sie sagt immer so süß, dass äh, alle Erwachsenen total seltsam sind. Ah ja, und bevor ich es vergesse, wir haben auch gerade noch gehört, dass der Vater von Alex gestorben ist. In dieser Nacht, in der gleichen Nacht und offensichtlich gelitten hat. Und Alex meinte dann, nein, nein, das ist schon okay so. 
So, hey, uh, you read comics? Yeah. Well, a little. I do. I love comics. I used to want to draw comics. Me and my friend Kat were going to make one. Why didn't you? Life got in the way. You know how it is. Actually, you're a kid. You probably don't. Hey, I know a lot of things. I'm sure you do, kiddo. I used to do ballet, you know. Really? You don't look like a ballerina. Uh, well, thanks, I guess. I hate ballet. I keep trying and trying, but I don't get any better. You seem pretty good to me. No, I don't. I hate it. Why do you keep doing it, then? My daddy wants me to. He says it's a good way to meet other girls my age. Oh, man. That takes me back. That's exactly why my dad pushed me into it, too. Didn't work, though. The other girls didn't like me. I was either a better dancer than them, which made them jealous, or a worse dancer than them, which made them tease me. In the end, I got thrown out of class for smashing one of the huge mirrors. <laughs> Maybe I should do that. Don't go getting ideas, Missy. I'm a terrible role model. I like your necklace. Thanks. My boyfriend bought it for me. You have a boyfriend? Gross. <laughs> uh, actually, he's my ex-boyfriend. But there's nothing gross about it. But boys are totally gross. Yeah, I probably thought the same at your age. Trust me, you might change your mind, though. Sadly. What was your boyfriend's name? Gavin. Gavin Catrelli. He has a silly name. He's a silly man. What's your name, by the way? Lydia. Well, great to meet you, Lydia. Anyway, I should leave you to your practice. Okay. Come back and see me later. <laughs> so was von sie's. <laughs> Gross. Also Jungs sind doof und eklig und überhaupt. Sie haben kurz noch über ihren, ihren Ex gesprochen, also den Ex von Alex natürlich, der offensichtlich Gavin Catrelli heißt. Und ja, sie macht übrigens überhaupt nicht gerne Ballett, die Kleine, sondern macht das nur wegen ihrem Vater, weil der gesagt hat, das sei ein guter Weg, andere Mädchen kennenzulernen. Maybe I should go see Dawn, ask if Lang's awake yet. Ja, und ich wollte es gerade noch fertig sagen. Alex hat sich halt daran erinnert, dass es bei ihr genauso war. Dawn said I shouldn't disturb him yet. Aber die wollte doch gerade nachgucken, ob der wach ist. Das würde mich übrigens auch sehr wundern. Hey! Even miss. Any sign of our doctor friend? Well, I tried to wake him, but he was out cold. It seemed unkind to shake him awake. I could go get some cold water if that'd help. <laughs> Can you imagine? I'm imagining it now. And trust me, it's tempting. Anyway, Don, I wanted to ask you a question. Well, ask away. But first, I have one on my own. Shoot. You called me by name just then. Why? Uh, isn't that what people do? I never told you my name, Missy. Pretty sure you did. Reckon I didn't. Anyway, it's no matter. Just something to think on, is all. Maybe a little bird told you. How strange. I'm sure you must have mentioned it. Anyway, I wanted to ask about that picture in the corridor. I noticed it as I went past. You mean the one of old Gloria? No, the other one. The portrait. The young woman? Oh, I. Huh. Yep. Who was she? I couldn't help but notice the similarities. To who? Me! Don't say you can't see it. Oh, aye, now you mention it. She does bear a striking resemblance to you. Then again, you all look the same to me after I've had a drop of whiskey. <laughs> who was she? Don't rightly know. She came with Gloria. Maybe she's someone's daughter. Well, yeah, I imagine she was. Most women are a daughter at some point. Aye. You're a daughter, I imagine. Well, yeah. Grew up around your dad, did you? 
Uh, can we, like, not talk about my father right now? He kind of passed away very recently. Oh, I. Sorry, lass. I'm sorry for your loss. Uh, it's okay. I knew it was time. He was my stepfather, but I loved him like a dad. He loved me like a daughter, too. At least up until he stopped recognizing me. What about your mum? Are you and her still close? Still? Well, I assumed... Uh, you assumed wrong. We were never close. I'm sure that's not true now, lassie. I'm sure everything she did had your best interests at heart. Hang on. Hang on. You don't know anything about her. Or me, for that matter. Look, I'm sorry. This conversation's creeping me out, okay? Oh, lassie. Uh... Ah, balls. There we go. Into the tunnel. No idea why old Gloria craps out every damn time here. Settle down. We're in this for the long haul. What? Uh, how long till the lights come back on? Huge tunnel. Gonna be a good 15 minutes. I've got a candle here, but nothing to light it with. Um. Yeah. Schön. Dunkel im Zug, der gar kein Zug ist. Also die beiden haben jetzt eine Konversation geführt über ihre Mutter. Sie selber meinte, dass sie nicht so eng verbunden sei mit ihr und er hat versucht, sie vom Gegenteil zu überzeugen, was mich genauso wieder stutzig gemacht hat, wie das Gespräch von Floyd und Lang. Also möglicherweise weiß der Don mehr über sie, als sie es vielleicht wahrhaben will. Hm. Okay, er braucht, er hat eine Kerze. It's too dark to go fumbling about right now. Er hat eine Kerze. It's too dark. Ja, ja, ja. Ach, wir haben hier einen. Ja. <lacht> ja, natürlich. Sie raucht, ja. Here, use this lighter. Good work, lass. Must have given my matches to that funny fella in 2B. He likes to play with fire, so he does. Well, that sounds astonishingly unsafe. It's all right. I told him to be on his best behavior. It's not every day we have guests. This is a passenger train. Is it? What? Where the hell did he go? Something's not right about him. Something's not right about this place. Fuck it. I'm going to knock on Lang's door. Oh ja. Das geht ja gleich hier super weiter. Don ist einfach verschwunden. I better not. Okay. Dr. Lang? No response. It's locked. Fuck it. I should go see if Lydia's okay. Sie möchte nach Lydia sehen. Das hätte mich auch echt gewundert, hätten wir den Dr. Lang hier nochmal angetroffen. They sound... Okay. Huh. It's locked. Uh, Lydia? You in there? Lydia? Shit. I need to get the door open somehow. Wie schon sagte, Kinder in Horrorspielen finde ich eher gruselig. Können wir die Tür aufbrechen? Na. Nah. Können wir nicht. Cards, money, mace, the usual. Na. Nah. Um, uh, Rob? Alex, hello. You came. They said you would. You promised you'd call. You never called. Why didn't you call, Alex? Rob, it's the middle of the night. Wait, what the fuck? 
Did you follow me here? Why are you on the goddamn train? Oh, Alex, come on. I've always been there for you, haven't I? When Gavin left you, when your dad died, when you were getting those threatening phone calls. Oh, God. I forgot about that. Exactly. So why wouldn't I be here now when you need me again? You're... You're right. Okay, fuck it. Pretty sure I've passed out and I'm dreaming this, but whatever. I'll run with it. Why do I need you right now? The Earth crawls, Alex. The sepulchre thunders towards its destination, like worms burrowing through the soil. From the skies, the predator swoops. Sap. Feast upon the eyes of God. Darkness. Silence. Then a sudden scream pierces the night. Rob, you're scaring me. I'm sorry. I'm getting caught up in the moment. I should go back to my compartment. Come and find me there when you're done with the girl. Lydia? I never told you about her. Slice the girl away, Alex. Look at her insides. Put her belly. Find the key. What the fuck? What the fuck is going on here? This is some fucked up, trippy nightmare shit. There's something on the table. <laughs>